friends, welcome to my channel, Bonnie's Tiny Hands. Today, we'll be looking at the Limit Showering App Project 13 from White Hat Jr. Let's get into the video. Okay, so the code is right here, and the design was already done for you. Okay, so first we start off with the Start button. On Event Start, click display minutes zero display second zero water use zero if these triangles are shown don't worry guys it's just the way it's supposed to be okay so next we have a time loop for display seconds equals display plus one and set text ibl label seconds this ibl means a label and seconds so this is display seconds, set text, label minutes, display minutes, and same for water used. Okay, so for the time loop, this time we have to put 60,000, not 6,000, 60,000. This, that's what I had trouble with. And then I changed it to 60,000. Next, display minutes, display minutes plus one, Display seconds equals zero, water used equals water plus five, and non-event stop click function. And this is to stop the time loop when the stop button is clicked. Stop time loop, display minute zero, display second zero, water used zero. So let's check to see if my code is working. And one, two, three, four. We're gonna wait for a minute here to see if it actually counts the liters. Okay, so now as you guys can see that it's counting all those. So until then, let's review some of the most critical parts until it gets to a minute, I'll show you guys. The, crit the parts which were hard for me were this and the stop click because the stop I thought it was only to put the stop time loop but then I it said that I needed to put display minutes equals zero and all that so it was the stop time loop was hard for me a little okay so now back to this it had counted the the minutes now it's a minute and eight seconds, nine seconds. Now it's five liters. Because they said that every minute it's supposed to be used by five liters. Okay, so now that's over with. Let's end the video. Bye, guys. See you in my next video. And peace.